Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Monday, October 24th, 2022. Good news, but also bad news this weekend. On Saturday, we turned a profitable college football card again on the strength of a seven-star Mountain West Conference Game of the Month win. However, we came back on Sunday and had my worst uh, NFL Sunday of the entire season. I went 0-3. Uh, top play was a five-star on the Lions. It lost. Uh, we did go 2-4 and four overall on Sunday. We did cash an MLS with Austin. Uh, we cashed in baseball with the Houston Astros. But again, uh, star of the show is the NFL right on Sundays, and we did go 0-3. 7-2 winning weeks now in college and pro football combined. And I've uh, looked at about 80% of the card for this upcoming week in college football. That's what I do on Sunday evenings. And we will have a seven-star going this weekend. Uh, High-end plays in college football now 8-1 on the season. College football going back to late last bowl season now 27-11. and 11, End up over 7700 Bucks, but again, we got to bounce back also in the NFL this week. As far as Monday, uh, passing the Monday night game, no opinion, so no free play, no premium play in Monday night football. I do have the NBA on Monday. We'll look to go to three and one on the season. And going back to the start of last year, we're now 113 and 75. That's 60%, and we're up almost 14,000 bucks. I do have a four star Monday night play on my homepage in the NBA, and uh, also have afternoon soccer on Monday's card, so you can check that out also on my homepage. Page. Let's get to my free play for Monday's NBA. It is the Rockets hosting the Jazz. Uh, Utah off to a 3 0 start. Got to give them credit because with all the changes they made, uh, getting rid of some star players, changing coaches, all that kind of stuff, uh, most thought this team was going to be in rebuild mode this year and really struggle. They still might, but they're off to a 3 0 start. We cashed with them uh, in their opener against Denver. However, I did go against them on Sunday and I lost uh, playing New Orleans. Utah was able to go into New Orleans, get the win in overtime, so hats off to them. However, this is a tough spot. Now they're taking on the Houston Rockets. Doesn't quite get the juices flowing for this young team in all likelihood like Denver does, or like playing on the road against Zion Williamson does. Plus, not only is it the second of back-to-back -back days, but this marks the third game in four days, and two of those three games, Utah had to go to overtime. They've been involved in some intense battles. As far as Houston, listen, it's not going to be a good season for this team long term. Uh, they have covered two of their first three games, even though they've yet to win a game outright, but I think they get that win tonight. As I'm cutting the video, the Rockets are a one-point favorite, unlike Houston as the comp play. Free play on Monday's card. And again, check it out. The uh, plays for me on Monday, premium plays, NBA. We'll look to continue the start to the winning season, plus soccer on Monday afternoon. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put Monday in the win column.